Now, one of Ireland's greatest ever golfers, Christy O'Connor Sr., has died at the age of 91. The president, Michael D. Higgins, and Thishuk Enda Kenny were among those to pay tribute to the Galway native. Mr. Kenny described him as a wonderful man who left an indelible mark on professional golf and the sporting world. Mr. O'Connor's nephew, Christy O'Connor Jr., died last January, aged 67. Christy O'Connor was an enduring sports star and golfing legend in a career spanning four decades. His feats of golfing brilliance were epitomised in the 1966 Carols International at Royal Dublin, where he finished Eagle Birdie Eagle, five under par for the last three holes, to beat Scotland's Eric Brown by two shots. Here it is, over the garden, and the crowd rushing right round, and the ball drops. Oh, what a wonderful shot from Christy O'Connor. Here it is. His home course in Royal Dublin. Look at that. O'Connor won a total of 24 international professional tournaments, played in 10 consecutive Ryder Cups, finishing on the winning team just three. once in 1957. An eagle three for Christy O'Connor. O'Connor was born on the 21st of December 1924 in Knocknacarra near Salt Hill, the son of a farmer whose small holding was located next to Galway Golf Club. In 1951, at 26 years of age, a joint 19th place finish at the Open held in Royal Port Rush got his career up and running. His relatively late start in tournament golf did not inhibit his progression and he would blossom and improve well into his 40s and remain competitive into his late 50s, finishing tied third in the Irish Open in 1982 at 57 years of age. Tremendous round. His many achievements in the game were recognised in 2009 with his induction into the World Golf Hall of Fame. It's been a great thrill for me to have this as my age now, 22 and a bit. Uh, I think that maybe I would have liked if I had it, got it a little earlier. <laughs> but the point of fact is this is good as any time. Christy O'Connor was a true legend of Irish golf and Irish sport, affectionately known as himself.